completed the win for combined northerners. In the lone ladies' encounter, SGU Knights, ladies, beat Petro Carib Queens Park Rangers, ladies, one goal to nil. That was the opening game of the competition. Geneve uh, Devani hit the winner in the 10th minute. The event continues this weekend. Um, St. Andrew's Outfit Paradise have drawn level with leaders Hard Rock in the GFA Premier Division after a big win over the weekend. Uh, they beat Bald Dogs three goals to one at Progress Park in the Big Parish to move to 34 points, joint with Hard Rock, who were leading all the while. It was a timely win for the St. Andrew's team, which gives them a good chance to win the title, having played a game less than Hard Rock. Paradise is the only unbeaten team to date in the competition. Hard Rock slipped up badly, being beaten two goals to one by Eagle Super Strikers in the St. Patrick's Derby. It was the second loss this season. Third place Queen's Park Rangers moved to 30 points with a 1-0 win over Functional United. Uh, Functional United had beaten Rangers by a similar margin a week ago. Hurricanes, meanwhile, beat five stars, four goals to nil at the Alton George Park in Victoria, while GBSS and Happy Hill played to a one-all draw. That game been played at the Boucher Dupain Field. That sports, I'm Trevor Thwaites. Next time we're planning a business seminar, training workshop, staff party, cocktail party, graduation or conference, and you need space, contact the Grenada National Stadium to reserve your space. Affordable, easily the best prices you will ever find. Classy, up to the time, and modern facilities. Choose your package. Choose Tell your us package. what you want. Contact the Grenada National Stadium on 435-2007 or book online www.grenadastadium.com. www.grenadastadium.com. The Grenada National Stadium, a world-class environment. Catering to the needs of all people. Thank you, Trevor. Recapping the main points, government reiterates it will exercise the option to purchase majority shares in Grenlec. New system of managing abattoirs and markets soon to be in operation and agreements signed between two companies and their bargaining agents. That is the GIS News. I'm Leslie and Johnson Cornwall. On behalf of all those who made it possible, we thank you. For